Prince Harry will hold a bilateral meeting with U.S. First Lady Melania Trump when he travels to Canada later this week to host his Invictus Games. Royal watchers had been hoping for an announcement about Harry's first official public appearance with Toronto-based girlfriend Meghan Markle, but Kensington Palace have instead announced talks will take place between the royal and Mrs. Trump. The prince built up a strong rapport with previous First Lady Michelle Obama, who is a staunch advocate for U.S. military veterans, and attended the opening of the 2016 Invictus Games in Orlando, Florida. The Invictus Games in Toronto are just three days away pic.twitter.com g5 actual kensington palace at kensington royal september 20 2017 it is likely mrs trump a former model will be in canada to support the large american contingent taking part in the games a paralympic style global sporting tournament for wounded servicemen and women and veterans in Toronto where Suits actress Marco lives and works Harry will attend events associated with the Games on Friday before giving a speech at the opening ceremony on Saturday evening. During the eight-day Games, Harry will visit training sessions and watch participants competing in all 12 sports, including athletics, cycling and wheelchair basketball. He will also hold talks with Canada's Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. HRH starts his official program with a visit to Etpa Foundation Symposium on 22 September to hear panelists talk about veterans' affairs. Kensington Palace at Kensington Royal September 20, 2017 He will also meet at Davidgenston, at Canadian Mint at Flotus. Kensington Palace at Kensington Royal September 20, 2017 The Prince, who is widely expected to wed his American girlfriend will also visit the Mental Health and Addiction Teaching Hospital, hand out Duke of Edinburgh International Gold Awards to Young Canadians, attend a conference on military and veteran health research, and host a reception for the Invictus Games Foundation during his stay. The actress, who has been dating the Queen's grandson for just over a year, revealed her love for the prince in an interview with Vanity Fair magazine, prompting speculation the announcement of a royal engagement was merely a formality. The actress declared we're two people who are really happy and in love, adding I hope what people will understand is that this is our time. This is for us. Harry, who founded Invictus and held the inaugural Games in 2014, will be in Toronto from September 22 to September 30. The high-profile closing ceremony on September 30 will feature performances by Bruce Springsteen, Brian Adams and Kelly Clarkson.